We're trekking pals Habiba and Alex. And for the last few weeks, we have been calling Alaska home, working from our little tiny Airbnb during the week and hitting the hiking trails during the weekends, exploring the last frontier, challenging ourselves, learning, and appreciating the opportunity to escape the heat of the desert. Today's adventure is taking us to a gorgeous port city in southern Alaska called Seward. Seward is known for being a hot spot for commercial fishing, as well as the gateway to Kenai Fjords National Park, where glaciers flow from the Harding Ice Field into coastal fjords. So we're checking a couple of uh, shops and uh, fishing charters in this area. This is the famous spot where you will go on a fishing charter, come back here, and you will take a picture with uh, whatever you caught. Caught at Seward, Alaska, with probably big fish hanging on the hooks there. Uh, there is a cleaning station here to clean all the fish. And then the view from here is really nice. <laughs> Booba? Yes, Excited? Yes, Let's go. Very pretty view of Mount Marathon. bunch of sea otters just swimming and enjoying the weather. <laughs> Did you see them? Yeah, yeah, I got a picture too. It really was interesting. He was just kind of like sliding through the water. My hair is going so wild on me today with the humidity and this is the best that I can come up with for right now. But we are going to the Sea Life Center here in Seward. We were told all the good stuff about it. They do have a bunch of animals rescued, we're in trouble. So yeah, let's check it out. Oh, he's just there. He's <laughs> chatting with the other one. They're just like speaking through the. <laughs> oh, he's just right there. There's the, an observation deck outside to check uh, whales which will be very neat. I know that Alex really wants to see some uh, whales on this trip. I am a whale. Ooh. <laughs>
This is a very good uh, cheat sheet behind me. How long some mammals can hold their breath underwater. So we're looking at uh, polar bears, about one to three minutes. Humans, usually one to two minutes with the world record of 20 minutes. And then orca whale, 12 minutes. Sea lions, 12 minutes. Humpback whale, 15 to 30. We have the deepest human dive of seven, zero one feet and then the deep down where it gets really dark and lonely and cold is where the sperm whale thrive and they can hold their breath up to 90 minutes we're gonna check our way together with the gopro ready for 11. The area is also famous oh. for a lot of <laughs> gold mines. I'm just gonna show you a little thing here. Oh, real gold. 24 karat gold. Yeah. We're still starving right now and we're gonna go to a restaurant here called Shinox. But uh, yeah, just time for some grub. What have you got, Alex? I brought some fried halibut. Halibu. Halibu. Some fries. And then fries. I just need to demonstrate. <laughs> <laughs> You've got some halibut, the fries, rice looks really good, and actually. broccoli. I'm jealous of your plate. We can have some. After a memorable day exploring the streets of Seward, it's time to check into our place for the night with one of the most epic views of the ocean. Thank you all for watching, your trekking pals Habiba and Alex, and we will see you very soon on the next episode.